Hello and welcome. Here we are back again in the uh, the latest pre-release of uh, Minecraft for 1.6. As you can tell, I've expanded my horizons a bit. Uh, so we have plenty of room. It's lit up here, but uh, there was a cave just outside that I wanted to go investigate. And I've got uh, a few tools here. I'm going to go through the stone pick. And I'm going to keep the shears in case I happen to run into a mine shaft. Uh, got a chest down here. Got a little bit of iron left. I uh, got the shovel off of a zombie. I suppose I can keep it in my inventory. I'll end up using the iron shovel anyhow. And I can use that to repair. Been playing too much Feed the Beast. I keep on trying to middle click on my chest to sort them. But, uh,. We were positioned next to a set of caves. There was some uh, iron at the top of these that I kind of decided, you know, I could use a little bit more iron, so I went and got. But uh, other than that, I haven't really explored these. So. Looks like a pretty extensive cave system. Yeah, this is going to be nice. This is definitely a good find. Uh... Where exactly in the daylight are we currently? Or more of in the night time. The moon has just risen. We're looking at probably about seven and a half more minutes of night time. Uh, with that said... Uh, okay, look at my clock. So... In about seven and a half minutes, just try and get out of the cave. Uh, I'm still not entirely sure how the horse spawning algorithms work. Eight. Hey. Oh, come on now. So, I don't know about everybody else, but having gravel... Really? Really? Well, isn't that fucking convenient? <laughs> What is with my luck and finding spawners so early into my Let's Plays? I mean, I now have a zombie spawner. I could make a XP farm out of it, or whatever the hell I wanted, but let's see what we got. Ooh, a name tag! That's new. Record. Couple of buckets, could use some buckets. Uh, some wheat. More iron, more buckets. Wow! I officially... I'm rather pleased. I will take these chests, though. I'll come back for the mossy later. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it, though. I uh, probably will turn that into a trap of some kind, because... Well, yeah, having an XP farm could be handy. But then again... I mean, I'm probably eventually going to make an Ender XP farm, or maybe I just won't even bother, but... Uh, one of the things I want to do for sure is I want to try and actually get to and kill a wither pretty quickly because uh, if you watch my Feed the Beast Let's Play, you'll know that I'm getting to the point where I need nether stars for some of the stuff I want to move on to. And, yeah. I don't want to fight the wither in Feed the Beast until I fought it in vanilla. So, yeah, that's my plan there. Uh, there's also the fact that uh, I've seen plenty of people kill it in diamond armor. I've even some seen some people kill it in uh, iron armor. And I'm just curious as to what exactly is... Like, how hard can I make it to kill it? But at the same time, I need to make sure that if I do that, I don't completely screw myself. I need to have a backup set of good armor. And I've also been very unlucky with getting nether wart for potions, which would help drastically in fighting the wither. Uh, probably going to want at least a decent bow, maybe. Maybe I should just work up, enchant some, like, uh, iron armor. My throat's being a bit scratchy, for some reason. And then just fight the wither with some decently enchanted iron armor. Decent, you know, probably a diamond sword. I've never really been too big on making diamond armor, because it almost seems like a waste. 
but who knows. Hmm. Whoops. Didn't finish mining that. Good supply of iron, though. Cave is less... less interesting than I was expecting. Oh, come on now. I want you to shoot the creeper. Shoot the creeper. Come on now. Is it so much to ask for you to just shoot the creeper? Okay, creeper was not as hurt as I was expecting. Might have slightly, uh... That looks like... Quite possibly a ravine combined with a ravine, or maybe just a rather open cave. Oh, well, there goes that. Probably gonna want to go back up soon. Uh, should be about two and a half minutes until daylight, roughly. No, hi, skeleton. So, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to, at each one of the uh, the splits... That's not where you're supposed to be. Where did I... I came down right there, I think. I'm going to put a double torch so I can see where I left off. And then hopefully I'll be able to use that to get back down here minimal effort. Back to exactly where I was. That's the plan, anyway. Well, that was interesting. Uh... Ooh, good timing. Asshole. Okay, bones. Damn you, grass, trying to kill me. Well, that wouldn't have killed me, but... Damn you, grass, trying to get me killed slowly and painfully. The thing is, I could technically even build a mine down there at some point. That is a lot of skeletons. Holy crap. Um, I guess we'll just do a quick check around this plane, see if we see any horses. Got some cows. It's always good. There's at least two of them, so I can breed those, no problem. Give me a source of food and leather. Um... Pool of lava, so I can make a portal to the nether. Quite a bit of planes, too. So hard to find some planes. And once I find them, they go on forever. Don't get me wrong. It's not a bad thing. Are you gonna load, world? Load? Load? See cows? Hmm. Pumpkin. I don't know what is going on with the world loading. This is a bit extreme. Well, I know there's a mine shaft down there. That ruins that. And I know it connects to a ravine, which also ruins that. Thanks, fail world loading. Ruined my perfectly good experiences. There's a hell of a lot of a mineshaft network down there, though. The 
That is a bit insane. Hmm. I'm going to have to look and see if horses just spawn or if I'm going to have or if they're uh, naturally spawned with the world. Cuz that's one thing I don't know. Chickens, chickens, chickens. Wow, world's smallest cave. Hmm. If you know anything about whether or not horses spawn with the world, feel free to let me know. Or if they will just randomly spawn. I'm hoping they function a lot like wolves and they just randomly spawn. But... No promises on that. What is with the world loading? Seriously, is just insane. It's almost as ridiculous as the number of eggs I've picked up so far. Look at that, 12. No! I'm actually trying to see through the world and it's keeping up with me. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, come on. Let me out. Hmm. Am I still in planes? Yes. Yes, I am. What is with the one random skeleton? Hmm. I'm going to be running out of planes soon. See, this is still considered planes. Well, that's clearly desert, so... Oh. Sprint jumping is a very good way to run out of... Uh, hunger very quickly. There's another cave right down there. Still see my house. Horses are surprisingly difficult to find. Well, I know there's a uh, whole mine shaft network down there too, as well as a uh, maybe a double cave spider spawner somewhere down that direction. Because that was a ton of cobwebs. Look at that. Huh? Actually, there might only be one there. There is a possibility of two, if you look at it just right, though. I'm actually trying to see if there's any other, like, normal spawners. Oh, speaking of which, does anybody know? I guess I'll find out eventually, but... The question is, can you get name tags from mineshaft chests? Because that is another question I do not know the answer to. But I'll figure it out eventually, I'm sure. Hmm. There's a lot of planes around me, but no horses. It would just be absolutely revolting if they, you know, don't just normally spawn, like how wolves can just spawn in a place and despawn in a place, but they're a lot rarer than every other, like, mob, neutral mob. Hmm. I seem to have slightly lost track of my house all of a sudden. Although, I have entirely lost track of myself, so that's not saying much. Hmm. Hmm. What are you doing flying around during the middle of the day, Bat? Like, what is that all about?
Wait a second here. Why did that look like two perfectly box-shaped things that were unloaded there? I'm assuming just part of them loaded and that's what happened, but still. Okay, there's the desert again. Nothing that looks like a horse so far. Is that the same desert? It very well could be. Although I could also very well be lost, so... Yeah. Let's see if I can't find my house. And then I guess that'll be a kind of a note to stop on. Hmm. I might go round up some uh, cows and make a wheat farm or something in between. But, uh, yeah. House. Where are you hiding? This is seriously just abysmal world loading speed. This is depressing. Okay. Heading into a snow biome. Not where I want to be. Oh, God damn it! as long as I stay in... Uh, planes. I'll find my place eventually. There's a lot of lava down there. Hmm. I seem to have gotten myself slightly lost. Why do I have this bad feeling? I've actually skirted around my house multiple times. And haven't even noticed because the world didn't want to load. Is that the dirt patch of a mine shaft down there? I guess I'll never know. Uh, this water patch almost looks familiar. Well, apparently almost looks familiar. It was not. Now, oh, come on. I've been in a planes this entire time. Oh. Oh, there's my house. R randomly appearing house. Uh, looks like if I f keep going through that cave system, I would eventually end up at a mine chef, though, if I'm seeing that right. So that's quite handy. I came out of there with quite a bit of coal and iron. And an additional chest. What is it? I think locked chests. You could create uh, double chests next to other chests. And it's just made with, I think, tripwire hooks and sticks. Or, well, tripwire hooks are made with sticks. What is it? That? That? Is it? Is it a wooden plank? I've never actually tested this. No, that's going to mean to make a shovel. Uh... Hmm. The fact that I don't know how to make a tripwire hook kind of says that I should probably look that up to. But seriously, I thought it was just like iron and a stick or something. Is it and a button? No. No idea. I suppose I'll place this here. Worry about that later then. 
This is... Oh! Don't do that. Put the name tag in there, because it's fairly important. Uh, same with the saddle and a piece of wheat and some string. Ooh, we can make a lead. One, two, three, four, I think it is. And a slime ball. Now, uh, I think it's one, two, three, one. Leads! Okay. Cool. There's a lot of eggs. Uh, I've got some bread. Got plenty of buckets. With the dirt in there. Top off the stack of cobble I have. Uh, I might build the house out of more different use different types of stuff than usual. I might like use some like maybe build a cobble foundation. So like the bottom here would be like cobblestone. And then I could have like wood. But I could like build the frame with say like stone bricks or something to act as supports. Just trying to think here. Not entirely sure how much this is actually going to happen. Just trying to, you know, ad lib it in my head. Um, yeah, can't play that record till I have diamonds. But we do have a fairly decent amount of iron now. 34. Cool deal. Uh, I think I'm going to stop here at this for now. Uh, I'll actually do some research, figure out how to make a tripwire hook, uh, figure out how to... You know, see if I can't figure out more about horses. And I'll be back with you guys next time. Have a good day.